Hey, what's up, my friends? It is Vasters, aka G Saves, and I'm back with another video. For this video, we're in the game Knights and Dragons, and this is a complete tutorial on how you can actually customize your character name and or guild information to have a certain emoji or something like that. You might have like the gold uh, icon or the gem icon that is on the top right uh, just displayed, you know, on your character name and or guild information. It is very, very cool, and it is a little bit difficult to do if you don't know what you're doing so i'm gonna run it step by step guys on how i managed to actually get this working but let me show you guys my character page so for my character page you will notice little symbols and stuff like that here's the gems that i was talking about the earth element water element fire element air element and dark shadow element so guys how exactly did i manage to get these things to work some people say that it doesn't work for them so they had to download a specific app that gives them a different keyboard i myself didn't really have to do that i just went to a certain web page i'll leave a, one of um, one of the web pages down below guys and uh basically it's gonna run you down through like if you do this it will display this it's a certain like little like it's not really a code but it's a certain text and if you put it it displays you know a certain um symbol on this game which is really really cool they could actually they could have made money off of this too like if they actually made this like premium gems or something like that you have to buy um to use a certain icon they could have made some money out of it but it's pretty cool that it's free um but let me show you guys on this guy as you can see um what you want to call it the the gems are right here you can't really like i can remove one if i want to but how do you add another gem basically guys there's a certain web page like i said in the description down below that i should be placing there hopefully i didn't forget but it will actually take you to a certain website and there will show a bunch of codes a bunch of little text that will display certain things so for example guys let me actually open up a certain page right now and let me type something up and let me show you guys because I, I can tell you this much it does glitch out and I actually had to fix it I had to actually do something to fix it so basically this is the air element and I'll show you guys real fast so I go here here appearances and I just all I did was copy the specific text from the web page and then I just paste it so that's control C or control V and if you're on the phone you just simply hold uh, the button and it should work hopefully by doing that um, but if I do that as you can see there it is uh, the air element so if I selected this is okay and then I did this you will see the air element is now being displayed uh, on my character and like I said you can also do this on the guild tab as you can see I do have something being displayed right there which is pretty cool that you can do that it makes it look more professional more uh, neat and stuff like that it's pretty cool and uh, sometimes though there, it does bug out and it does glitch out um, I don't know if it will bug out right now but there's some certain symbols that for some reason it didn't work for me um, let me try the arena energy for example let's see if this works as you can see right now I'm trying to paste it it's not working so the thing I did guys is I grabbed the air element because that's the one that really works really well and then I get, uh, I get um, let's say the arena energy, and I paste it after it. So then I, I have two symbols. Okay, so then when I go back and I paste it, it will display both of them. So this one right here was not working if I try to paste it on my own, like on its own. So what I did, I put the air element first, and then I put that one, and it works. So then I could just click backspace, and I'll show you guys exactly how to do this. So you click OK, and then you want to go back. So you do like that, and then you click OK. And then you have that certain symbol that maybe you wanted to have. So there you go. Um, so be aware that sometimes uh, the symbols don't work. For me, the fix is simply to grab the air element or a different element, um, a different icon that does work for you. Put that first. Like basically, let's say if it was the gem element uh, icon thing was working, but this one was, was not working. All you have to do is simply copy this one and then that one so you're copying both together but make sure the gem is first and then it works i don't know why it does that but it's that easy guys like it's seriously that simple and it can make a character and or guild information look really really cool as you can see i did this for all the characters 
it looks awesome like it just does it makes it look so awesome so professional and same thing with the guild i mean this looks sick but uh that's it guys it's really really easy like i said in the description will be the website and uh, you guys can copy and paste you know these icons and have some fun you know there's a bunch of them you have the air element earth element fire element spirit element water element star metal element you have a timer, experience star, gold, gems, fusion stone, weird key, silver key, enchanted key, dark prince key, wind symbol, arena energy, fist, black box, boost, and so much more, guys. There's so many icons that you can use, and hopefully this helped you guys out. And uh, and yeah, I'll see you guys when I see you guys, though. My name is Vasters, aka G Saves, and I am signing out. So may Jesus Christ be with you guys, and God bless you guys.